This video is for you if you have been experiencing emotional pain of any kind. I have a specific exercise, one of my favorite techniques that I'm going to share with you and we're going to do it together right here in this video. It's a technique called Emotional Freedom Technique and it's a specific script that I have created for my private clients that I use in my practice and I wanted to share this with you because I know a lot of people are struggling with emotional pain right now and I feel this exercise will really, really help you. So let's get to it. Okay, so if you've never done emotional freedom technique before or else called tapping, I will link below to a video explaining what that is and how to do it. But even if you've never done it before, that's no problem at all. You can just follow me and just mirror everything that I'm doing. If I'm tapping here, tap here. When I'm sharing certain words, I want you to repeat after me. So it's pretty simple, yet it's very, very powerful. So let's get to it. Letting go of emotional pain with emotional freedom technique. Okay, so let's start by tapping right here. Even though I feel this emotional pain, and it can feel pretty overpowering at times, I now choose to shine a light on it and to start to let it go. Even though I'm experiencing hurt, sadness, an emotional pain. I recognize these emotions and they're just here to deliver a message and then I can let them go. Even though feeling emotional pain can feel very painful and I cannot bear it at times. I acknowledge my sensitive heart and I give it love and compassion and understanding right now. Now let's tap up here at the top of the head. All this pain I'm feeling, all this emotional pain in my heart. I'm experiencing pain. It's okay to say it out loud. It's okay to feel this. Perhaps I'm not sure why I feel this. Perhaps I know exactly why I feel this. Either way, whether I know why I feel this or I don't know why I feel this, either way, I'm allowed to feel this way. I've been fighting and resisting this pain. A part of me does not want to feel this. It's just too much. Another part of me is really feeling it and is actually overwhelmed by it. It affects my life and my relationships. Perhaps I even feel it as physical pain, not just emotional pain. I acknowledge both parts of myself, the part that's fighting and resisting the pain, and the part that's feeling swallowed up by it. I've been holding on to this pain and I just can't take it anymore. All this pain in my heart, in my body. Maybe I've been holding on to it from the past because of certain things that happened in my life. Maybe it's a more recent event that triggered all of this pain. Maybe I'm picking up on the collective's pain 
Maybe I don't even know why I feel this pain. No matter what it is, I choose to clear all of this right now. All this pain I feel is just an energy moving in my heart and my body. It's an energy in motion, e-motion, an energy in motion, delivering a message. I ask myself now, what is this message? What is this pain here to tell me? It carries a gift. What is it? I am open and I'm curious to find the gift of this pain. Perhaps it is here to point me to areas in my life that perhaps I haven't looked at before, or relationships, or my purpose. Perhaps it is here to show me that I've been protecting myself and that I'm ready to stand up for myself in certain areas in my life. Perhaps it's telling me that I haven't been fully expressing my true self and my true purpose. Perhaps I'm feeling pain because of what others around me or the world is experiencing. And all of that can understandably be experienced as pain, as emotional pain, and hurt, and sadness. Yet I'm now choosing to take my power back. This pain is no longer serving me. A part of me thinks that I'm supposed to feel this way and is resisting to let it go. But the other part of me is done with this pain. It's holding me back from living fully and I no longer want to not live fully. I choose to feel more joy. I choose to feel more love. I choose to feel more harmony. I let joy replace pain. I let love replace pain. I let harmony replace pain. I'm allowing myself to heal. I'm calling in my higher self, source, spirit, universe, God, however you want to call it, to facilitate this healing. I surrender all past hurts and pain and all present hurts and pain. I surrender that all to source. I give it all up for transmutation. I'm releasing all anger and all resentment from all the roots and the cells and the fibers of my being. I am letting my higher self take all the pain away. Recognizing that when I forget who I truly am, the ego creeps in and pain comes back. I choose to remember my true self. When I equate myself with the body and the ego, I invite pain back. And now I choose to remember who I am as a spirit in a body. My true self is calling for my attention because I know deep down that that's where true freedom from pain lies. 
with my higher self. That's what pain has been trying to tell me all along. It's been trying to tell me to look beyond the ego self and into my true self. Because whatever the ego directs my body to do or feel will be painful. And whatever my true self directs my body to do and feel will be joyful. And I choose joyful. I choose to listen to the wisdom of my higher self that knows the bigger picture and the reason for all things. And as I release all this emotional pain from myself, I'm helping release it from the collective too. As I am healing myself, as a ripple effect, I'm helping heal the planet. As I give myself permission to release this pain, I help others give themselves permission to do the same. As I allow myself to feel more joy, so do others will feel it too. And so it is. Take a deep breath in and out. Thank you so much for being part of this. I hope you're feeling the release of the emotional pain. You can repeat this exercise many times. And right after this, you can go back and do this again and again and again until you start feeling more and more release of this emotional pain. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you want to dive a little bit deeper into the root causes of emotional pain, certain aspects in your life that you might want to dive a little bit deeper into, I have created a free three-part masterclass, The Three Secrets to Break Free from the Vicious Cycle of Feeling Stuck. I'm going to put a link below and I'll be happy to see you there too. Thank you again, leaving you in whole wellness. Bye-bye.